What's good, YouTube? I'm back with another video. It's your boy Trill Jimmy, and then we got a special guest, my boy. What's good, L A R O C K A? Hey, we got my boy Larock, <laughs> no cap. I used to watch this nigga back in the day when I was trying to get when I was trying to get dreadlocks and shit. You know, you know, you know. But I'm here in Atlanta, Georgia. Y'all know I'm out of Florida, but hey, we moving to Atlanta soon. We moving to Atlanta, and we finna do some interviews. We gonna ask people some questions. I just dropped one today that I recorded yesterday. So y'all go crazy on that. Y'all go watch that one. Y'all go crazy. Y'all go spam the like button. You feel me? But we gonna see y'all on the streets of Atlanta. You feel me? We gone. Just gonna ask people a whole bunch of whole bunch of questions. Like talk about life. We might ask a lot of. Oh shit. We gotta go upstairs. There's hella niggas here. This shit. All right. Today I am here with. Thirst, Sam. Tia. James Bell. Hey, James, I want to ask you, what is the meaning of life to you? What does life mean to you? And what is the meaning? To find a purpose and be happy. Okay, okay, okay. Every response <laughs> is a response. There is no right or wrong answer. Word. You know, for me, being a dad, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's my meaning right there. You uh, know what I'm saying? Family. This is my family uh, here. <laughs> my wife, uh -huh. my son-in-law, my daughter from Florida, them, and my uh, grandkids. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. And Having my, you know, two boys. Uh -huh. Shouts to La Rock and Keaton. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Love, that's love. You're just enjoying life and trying to survive, especially during these hard times. There you go. There you go. I love it. I love it. What is the meaning of life to you? What does life mean to you? Let me think for a second. Hold all right, on. all right. They thinking, they thinking. Uh, I guess to me it's just being, um, want me to hold it? Yeah, you cool. Um, just being free and at peace with like the choices you make. Don't like look back and like say, I wish I woulda, I wish I shoulda. If you want to do it, do it. Mm. And that's it. That's just there it for go, me. There you go. I like the answer. <laughs> I like the answer. What does life mean to you? Why is she recording you? Why she I don't know. <laughs> Something I used to say in college was swag and smile. Swag and smile. <laughs> that's it. I like that. What's the meaning of life? What does life mean to you? I feel like to so find your purpose and find what you're happy with. And like right. live your life out, yeah. Right, 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 right. Hundred percent. Find your purpose and just stick with it. You know what I'm saying? Migo. Yeah. Vars eight five zero. Yeah. So my question for y'all is, what is the meaning of life? What does life mean to you? There's no right or wrong answer. Whatever, whatever it means to you. Uh, do whatever you want. Don't let anybody tell you what you can't do. Short and simple. I love it. Yeah. Life means basically. <laughs> life kind of it. Well, really it. I let him go first. Like, what, it's like what you make it, basically. Yeah, right. Like what you for make real, it. For real. If, if, life is what you make it. Yeah. If I feel like it's a never-ending cycle. Like, mm. you feel me? I feel like life is like a video game. For real. You feel me? That's like it. a game of chess. Mm-hmm. And you gotta you gotta maneuver through it. Like you you give purpose to life. There is no specific thing. Like society tells us, you have to get a job. You have to go to college. You have to go to school. That's, but that's it's like it's way, bullshit. Nah. That's you the way of life they want us to do. Right. Right. That's right. Hundred percent. For me, it's a well perspective. It's mm -hmm. understanding people. People's, the people that we are surrounded by and letting them understand our own perspectives so we can combine this idea and create a connection that's deeper than, than the one that we are, like currently are seeing. And then from there creating something that can uh, inspire mm -hmm. or motivate somebody along the way and that gives them purpose to continue Beautiful. to live like a life full of fulfillment. Okay, I love it. I Maybe love to answer. live life to the fullest. Um, I don't know, I guess just That's a great answer. have fun. I yeah. love it, I love it. All right, y'all, today I'm here with... Marceau. And... Sam. What is the meaning of life to you? The meaning of life. My, the meaning of life to, to, to me, and it should be for everybody, is to to uh, bring glory to the, to the Creator, the Most High, God. First question, what is the meaning of life like to you? It's living, creating a legacy, um, just living your best life, I guess. 100%. Um, finding your purpose, creating your purpose, and being who you truly are. Facts. I mean, you just you just live your life to the fullest with no regret, you know? You go. Uh, can we curse on here? You, you straight. You, you free, <laughs> right, man. See Fuck the opinions. <laughs> My bad. Fuck everything else, man. Just, just do you, you know? And, and do what you got to do to survive out here. There you go. Because if not, you're going to get ate up. Ate up. <laughs> straight up. <laughs> I'm going to keep it simple and just being happy in whatever ways you can because that shit not as easy as it sounds. So, yeah. Facts. Life is, yeah. <laughs> um, I would say the meaning of life is 
allowing your happiness to be able to give to others, like your talents, to be able to be happy and give. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Go, girl. I'm gonna keep it simple as well and just say to do what you want to do on your own time, but also to give back to the others around you that you love. Okay. Facts. That was fine. That was fine. What is the meaning of life? Well, like, what do you, what does life mean to you? To get better at aspects of stuff that you're not good at. Okay. Okay. I don't know, I think life is like what makes like this fucking world like revolve around type shit, you feel me? Mm. Just like life in general, like you feel me, it's all human life. Like I feel like it would be nothing. <laughs> no, it would be like I bro. No. So like, <laughs> so, like I, bro. <laughs> so like without no life type shit, like this plan would be like boring type shit, like the rest, you feel me? Yeah. Okay, okay. What does love mean to you? Love? It don't matter who is with. All right, first off, maybe yo, your grandma, mom, whatever. Right. You do anything for that person. Uh huh. Anything at all, whether it's color. It don't matter. <laughs> uh, <laughs> love is just. It makes you do some things that uh, you just worth 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 doing. Hell yeah. Why are you laughing at his ass? <laughs> why, why are you laughing at his ass? Though, man, love, man. Yeah. You know. It's a tricky thing, you feel me? Like, it's a very complex, you know, word, to be honest with you. But oh, yeah. really, it's just, you know, just how you feel about shit, you feel me? Just anything, yeah. like, you'll, you'll, you'll just... Any, honestly, I learned everything about love from him. What so does he, love mean to you? tell you. <laughs> what does love mean to you? What you mean you learn from him? Learn from him. He, he said the name down and then. Uh, nah. What nah. you mean? Hey, yo, hey, yo. Wait a minute. This shit, no, 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 wait. Like, hey, what, is, what does love mean to you? What does love mean to me? Yeah. Um, it's an emotion, and just mm -hmm. like everything else, there's ups and downs to yeah. it, there's ins and outs to it, and you know what I'm saying? You play with it how you play with it. There you go. So, there you go. All right, appreciate y'all. What does love mean to you? What is love to you? Candies, yeah. No, I'm joking. <laughs> yeah, that's but no, I'm not joking, but yeah. You uh, know what I'm saying? <laughs> love, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Mm. All right, that's I it. I think love is really, to me, is what you what you invest your time in. You know what I'm mm. saying? That's what love is to me. That's a great you know answer. That's a great answer. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, my love, man. Bro. Thank you. Love me. Yeah. All right, so basically love to me is, you know, uh, loyalty and, you know, being respectful and considering your partner or whoever you're loving. You know, you got to take into consideration um, everything you do when you're loving someone else yeah. because it's not just about you, it's about them as well. So at the end of the day, uh, yeah, loyalty, compromising with your partner. There you go. There you Unconditional trust, um, someone you can always rely on, someone is always to look out for your best. 100%, bro, 100%. Yeah, definitely. Loyalty, um, trust, someone who you could be yourself around. Facts. Somebody to be vul more vulnerable to, yeah. I feel. Be vulnerable to the deepest sense of understanding. Mm -hmm. Because you understand that person so well and their heart so deep, you're willing to be patient with them and give them the time and the love that they need to grow into the person that they that you can see potentially on them. Yeah. There you go. Wow. <laughs> well, I feel like I have the worst answer. <laughs> no. There is no right or wrong answer. You are straight. Um, someone you feel comfortable with. Um, I guess someone you can be vulnerable with. I don't know. Yeah. Someone right. you can share your passions with. Yeah. There you go. Like you, you like somebody or something like that. You love someone. Yeah. I don't even know how to like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like to me, love means like loyalty, yeah. trust, yeah. stuff like that. Love. 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 <laughs> loyalty, I value. I value everything. Yeah, I agree. What's that? Loyalty. Loyalty. All right, for sure. Loyalty, I value. What does love mean to you? I know you're scared of this question, but you uh, love. Okay. Love. Uh, two people, two people, uh, that make each other better, okay, and have a little fun while at it. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, we gonna have to think on this one a little bit. <laughs> the meaning of love. Yeah. It's love. Like, love. What is, like, what does it mean to you? Place and then, mm. like, I was about to say more love. <laughs> um, All right, you good? There's no right or wrong answer. Be you. I don't know. What is love? That's a deep question. It is a deep, I need you to think. You gotta, <laughs> gotta get in there. I don't think you have this much camera. <laughs> <laughs> I will say something that was told to me once before, which is almost the same as the first one, is just love freely. Don't love someone, like, put barriers 
on them and have them in a cage like you can't do this you can't do that that's not love let the person be as free and genuine as they can be and if you can't accept them for what they are then let them go and if it's meant to be they'll come back but live that way with you too don't have any limitations on what you are and who you are accept yourself learn yourself <laughs> you can't love somebody else unless until you learn yourself first there you go Big great answer thank you guys so much i hey, appreciate no i appreciate no y'all it means i've been married 48 years to wow. the same woman beautiful high man. school sweetheart high yeah. school sweetheart yes Damn. love means commitment uh -huh. love means understanding yeah love also means letting each one be themselves and coming together um Comfortability, shit. Mm. Yeah. Oh, love, love, man. That is so crazy, man. Love. 2020 has taught me a lot. Mm. Love. Same here. It can be a feeling, but it's a choice. Mm. That's what it. That's what it means to me. There you go. Short and simple. I, I like it. How about you? I believe like the love is the absence of like yourself. Basically, like some may treat you wrong some way but yeah. you still don't take that to heart you still love you still love them no matter what yes, no sir. matter what they say yes so. sir it's something that comes from within it's something that you radiate you know the meaning of love it definitely means that to love someone throughout all their possibilities of what they could be so not just to love them in like the moment but for like all that they could be in their life I don't know. I think love might be just the willingness to give. Because you can love your friends, you can love a partner, you can love everything. But it's just... It's like, same thing as you said. Being there and supporting them. And just wanting yeah, wanting to be there, I guess. Okay, I would say that love has a lot of tears. And we're not here for a <laughs> crash course on that. <laughs> um, I would say, like, unconditional and true love is just about accepting a person. And being able to say, I will take this journey of life with you. Like so you can be whatever you want to be and I will accept you as that. Like, that's what love is. Facts. Okay. I appreciate you guys and yeah. <laughs> My next question, what does love mean to you? I know y'all look young, but what does love mean to you? There what is no right mean to Why are you me? laughing? Why are you laughing? <laughs> means like caring about the person next to you. I mean like you could, you huh? could. Well, yeah, like, oh, God, <laughs> That is so I'm zesty. <laughs> but like, yeah, it's like loving your neighbor. For sure, for sure, for sure. You, what, is, what does love mean to you? Having sexual orientation. <laughs> he just, he just like. And having yeah, sexual yeah, attraction. All right, all right. And caring a lot for one person. And you? No, 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 no. This man, hey, this man said he didn't want to be in my video. After he heard I had a million followers, he coming back. Back up. Wait, no. got a million? Yeah. What's up? What is love? Why do niggas think that's cap? Damn, you really got a million, nigga? Oh, wait, what's that? Because now I got a good What does love mean to you? But like, what does love mean to you? Love means like, um... You gonna say some deep shit because he on camera. No, 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 chill, chill, chill. Chill, chill bro, you fucking me up. So like, love means like, it's like... I don't know, I feel like people misuse love. Like, you know, people say that shit like real, like, real, like, loosely type shit. You feel me? Like, get your gay ass on. And then, like, you know, <laughs> so, like, I feel like people use that word loosely because they don't really know what it means type shit. You feel me? But, like, I feel like love means, like, you feel me? It's like you really connected to a, t a nigga type shit. You feel there you me? go, there you go. What do you think Les, about? What do you, what do you think? This is my interview. I mean, this ain't your interview. How do you feel about school? The school system, public education system? Uh, they don't want you booked on. They don't want you street smart. They want you booked on. They go, they want to, they want to dumb you down in school. So, right, 100%. So you don't know what's really what the fuck going on. Right, really what's they really, what's they, really, what's really they, going they really on. want you to work for the government. That's it. Yeah, in school, in school they not teaching you about being an entrepreneur, being right. your own boss. Right. They don't teach you how to make money. They teach you pointless shit. They don't right. teach you exactly. mental health. They don't teach you how to deal with emotions, but right. they teach us math. They don't, fucking teach, science. They don't teach us the business of life. Right. They, they don't, don't teach you how to make money. They don't teach us none of that shit. You know what School right now is setting me up to be something I don't want to be. You know what I'm saying? I agree with you, man. I agree. How, how old are you? Uh, 15. 15, man. How you feel about school? Honestly, man, honestly, be honest. I feel like I feel like honesty. I feel like school is like being a part of the system type shit. Cause it's like it's like being in prison. Like who the fuck goes to school? You feel me? Twelve hours a day right. type shit for twelve fucking years. You feel right. me? And then yeah. if you go to college, then it be like the same niggas. What you went to school for twelve years type shit just for you to what work at a donut shop? Right. This that you feel me? Like I feel like school is kind of useless. Like after I say like you feel me? Sixth, seventh grade, you learn about math. I feel hey. like and you just know. I feel like you should be able to be good type shit because you know like how to move. Like okay, hey, not. 
he right though. He right. He right. That's what's up. Yeah. That's it. Bye, I could have done my degree on YouTube. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about that. Hey, thank you. That's a topic that I can go on and off. But I think <laughs> it's it has a lot of um, problems because yeah. we're not taking in consideration the impact that mental health has in people. Right. How can you go and try to learn algebra when you're going? Your parents are like, you know, for example, beating you up and like right. you're going to school trying to, you know, just push to one more day and try to figure out like how am I worthy of life? Am I worthy of of continuing to pursue something that in the end is it's gonna mean nothing when I go back home, you know? And it's like when you don't, you don't know how to cope with those emotions, how can you be able to cope with it, with like process anything right, right, else? I believe that they they don't teach us the things that truly matter. Like you said, mental health, like they're teaching us things that we're not gonna use in real life exactly. instead of like yeah. how to control our emotions, how to handle depression, yeah. anxiety, things like that. Like some of it, some of it, like you need it, some of you, you need it, but the other stuff, like you, you can go without school like and make money. Facts, bro. Exactly, exactly. Like, there's other ways to make money outside of a nine to five, and we have the internet in today's age. Like, bro, we make money on social media nowadays. So it's like, it's crazy. But hey, appreciate you, bro. Real talk, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I feel like the school system is like just like the, it's like it's almost like the justice system as well. It's like it's there when you need it. It, it, it sometimes work, but not always. Yeah. I say the best thing you could do is like pick a good major and make sure that you have a job afterwards, even if it's like your dream job. As long as it's gonna take, take care of you and also provide for your future career. I definitely think it definitely needs a lot of work. Um, let's be honest, have we all used the quadratic formula out here in no. life? Never, know, not once in my I fucking life. I know with tax Absolutely. season coming up, me personally, I wish that they would have taught us that or something yeah. reasonable. We actually went to school at Grady, right down yeah. the street. Midtown. So I feel like mm -hmm. it's now Midtown High School. I feel yeah. like we had it a little better than like where we live now. Yeah. So I don't there know. Was a but it's more open-minded. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah, yeah, we, it was very diverse, and yeah. so we, yeah. Yeah, so it was, that yeah. was pretty good. 100%. <laughs> the public education system. Yep. Uh, I feel like a lot, it, t it took a big turn, a big shift in a, in a matter of 60 years. 100%. Oh, uh, man. First, we weren't even able to go to school <laughs> with, with right. other, other races. Right. Uh, my problem with the school system is that they are teaching kids that uh, creation, life itself, comes from nothing. I don't like that. Uh, evolution okay. itself, as as in an origin. Mm -hmm. Evolution is a process. It's not an origin. Like we can't come from an atom. When uh, they they don't teach people that they are created in the image of God. Um, it's good if you want to go into like one of those fields, like yeah. where you need it, like a doctor. So yeah, doctor. Lawyer. But other than that, but it's, it's not, not necessary. Bullshit, <laughs> it's right? Necessary. That shit, bullshit. Yeah. All right, shit. Short, simple, appreciate right, it, man. What it is, they teach us how to work a job in the future. Like you said, work for the government, but they don't teach us how to grow as a person. Brand. Yes. Okay, like, they have entrepreneur classes in high school or middle school and shit like that. Even in college, like I was in college for a little bit, for, as a business major, I didn't learn shit. Like I learned I learned more after I dropped out of college. You right. feel me? I learned more after That's I dropped like out me. of college. That's like me, I'm from the streets, but yeah. I graduated high school and went to college and played football, but yeah. I learned more on the streets than exactly. I learned in a book. Because I feel like the book was a lie. Like, for sure. I feel like they was lying to me. I feel like they tended me half of what I need to know. Dumbing you down. Dumbing you down. For sure. For sure. 100%. All right, y'all boys. Yes, Appreciate y'all. Appreciate yes, Um, With school, it's like she said, like the school to prison pipeline is a very real thing. So with school, take it with a grain of salt, but like learn what you can out of it. We should definitely implement more financial literacy into, into the school system, teaching kids about tax, credit, owning a home, how to save, savings account versus checking account, that kind of thing. Things that matter in the real world because I don't remember anything I learned in high school. Facts, facts, 100%. <laughs> and not only that, like you said, teaches about taxes. We should also learn about like mental health, yeah. how to meditate, how to grow food. Cause what happened, what would happen if like the whole system just crashed and like there was no more Publix, no more Walmart. What, what are we gonna do? We're done. Yeah. We're done. So, but yeah, thank you guys so much. Well, I think it depends on the state. I, I'm kind of new here to Georgia, I'm from New York. Okay. Some of the public school systems are not that great. Yeah. But my daughter graduated from public schools and she's a therapist now. So, you, go. you know, it depends on 
what you make it. There you go. You're right. That's right. That's right. You know Thank you, man. I appreciate you so much. Dance, you can get on Google. You get on Safari. Right, you can, you can look it up. Everything. Right. Everything. That's cool. Hell yeah. Shit. Y'all want to be in an interview? Not you. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> so, my man, my question to you is how do you feel about school? Hey, how old are you, too? I'm and your name? Uh, um, my name's Seven. I'm 13. Your name's Seven? Yeah. That's lit. I hate school. <laughs> I hate why, that shit. Why do you hate it? That shit don't make me no money. <laughs> I don't get no profit. No profit? No profit? Nah. And then, hold on, wait, bring it back. I have to do, I have to do work six hours a day. Six, like, so long. And then they're going to send me home with more work. More homework. What, what sense that make? What grade you in? Eighth. Eighth. Chase your dreams. You chase your dreams. Even though you said you didn't want to be in the video because you they did not. Just chase your dreams though. Chase them. Chase them. Thank y'all. Look look at Atlanta, bruh. This shit is beautiful. If you're not in the A, if you're not in the A, you're not in the ATL, get your ass over here right now. My boy LaRock, me and, me and my boy LaRock, bro, we finna take over Atlanta. We finna take over, you know? We in the A. We in the A.